Close to 10,000 members of the All Progressive Congress APC members and other opposition parties in Gwande local government area of Benue State at the weekend defected to the People's Democratic Party PDP. Hello everyone, you welcome to the news. The defectors were led to the PDP by a former stalwart of the APC and one-time special advisor on security matters, Cornel Basile Kwembe a former Kwande local government chairman, Tehile Lochio and a host of other APC and opposition letters, leaders in the area. This is the news coming up, you know, and it's a kind of victory for the political party, PDP, because, you know, it's an area, it's a, it's a time for political tussle right now and it's getting hotter by the minute in the political arena. The two main parties in Nigeria, that is the APC and the PDP, are doing everything and leaving no stones unturned to gain relevance in terms of getting people into their political party and also pulling the weight in different levels of, you know, governance in Nigeria. So with this, PDP has claimed victory over this and they are excited and happy and boastful at this, well, conquering other people from APC and other opposition parties. Well, the question is, is this good for democracy? Let's wait and see and get more updates. In just about 9 or 10 months before the 2023 presidential elections, it's, you know, it's been um, a roller coaster of different people expressing their different opinions and also the campaign from one political party to another will be something as common as the night and the day. We know politicians will always try to pull their weight and they are actually no permanent enemies but permanent interests. So in this light, we are going to wait and see how people are able to conduct themselves in this P, in this er, er, um, era of politicking. And the advice every youth is given is to get your PVC so that you can make a uniform decision. As we await the political parties to have their primaries where they determine who the party is going to nominate and all of that there's a lot of serious politicking going on on the ground and whatever it is being planned in such on the ground discussions will definitely come to light in the next few weeks and months in the presidential race there are a couple of people who have come out to indicate their interest but the person who has been at the front burner of it is a presidential aspirant Bola Ahmed Tinumbu who has gone round the political traditional rulers in southwest Nigeria and also gone round the beats in the northern part of Nigeria. The question is when will he get to the south east? So as we wait, we know it's a strategic planner, and we also know that for this campaign to be taking place, politicians are gonna be on their toes to make sure they don't lose out. Politics is a game of numbers. And right now, as we are preparing and getting into the political year, we just hope that every leader or leaders that are going to be in any level of governance will be leaders who are ready to take Nigeria just from a country to a nation where peace has always reigned, to a land flowing with milk and honey, and for a land that would stand proud and tall again as the giant of Africa. Thank you so much for watching please remember to like share and subscribe to my channel and also drop your contribution in the comment section below i'm sure to see you in my next video bye for now